Miss Lee, the defendant was your landlord. You want your security deposit back from him, half a month's rent, a cleaning bill, some other nonsense. Defendant says that you're a hustler, he's got a counterclaim, and counterclaim is for slandering him by accusing him of stealing his own property. What kind of property did you rent from the defendant? It was our house. Who did you rent it with? Uh, my boyfriend and a friend. Did you have a lease? Yes. May I see the lease? What's the friend's name? Jan. Judge, if I may, that's only partial. That's a, just a partial page in the lease. That's not the entire Can, lease. Do you have a copy of the lease? Yes. I'd like to see it. That's the only part of the lease that I received. There was some signed document given back to him. So three people are on the lease. You, Travis, is that you? Yes. And Jan. Okay, so you moved in in April. Correct. And signed this lease in April and paid the security deposit, which is eight hundred and thirty-five dollars and one hundred and fifty for mm -hmm. pet. One hundred and fifty for pet deposit. For pet. When did you move out? May twelfth. Why? Um, there was a dispute between us, and he gave. A dispute gave about what? Who was living at the property? Okay. Well, let's take it from the top. Okay. You have three people who were on mm -hmm. the lease, three people that were permitted to live there. Correct. So how could there be a dispute? What was the dispute about? So the night that my boyfriend and I moved in, um, when he was getting ready to leave with the moving vehicle, Charles came over to the house and asked who he was. Who was? Who Travis was. Your boyfriend, who, he had who met was on previously. the lease. Correct. Uh, I stated who he was. We left the conversation later on that night. He called me and asked again who it was. I referenced again that it was Travis. And then um, the next day he emailed in regards to a house meeting to verify who everyone was. Judge, can I interrupt? Just, just, no, you can't interrupt. Okay. You'll have a turn to speak. You can't interrupt. Okay. So he asked immediately upon your moving in, because you moved in not the 1st of April, in the latter part Very of end. April, mm -hmm. even though your lease started in Correct. April 1st. And I assume that your boyfriend, Travis, was there when the lease was signed. He wasn't there the day of signing. It says on the bottom there that he was to sign it. Um, he signed it and sent it back to him. Okay, so you had never met Travis. Is that... He Listen to me very carefully, Mr. Ruffley. You had not met Travis before they moved in. Uh, as far as I know, Judge, I did meet Travis before they moved in. When and under what circumstances? Uh, the day that they both came over to look at the house, to rent the house. And as far as I know... It's not the date that they signed the lease, but it, it was the date that they came over to look at it? Probably so. There would have been a time lapse there, yes. We started initiating the lease on the 23rd I, I, of March. I'm asking a simple question. Do not take me down a tributary. Okay. I asked you whether you had ever met Travis before. Travis, you haven't changed your appearance... Uh, no. ...since May. Nothing. You would remember if you met Travis. Uh, yes, but I don't believe that's Travis. That, as far as I know, is Yar. <laughs> Jan. Just a sec. Stand up. Do you have a wallet with you? Yes. Take it out. Gotcha. Take out your driver's license. Perfect. May I see it, please? Travis. Okay. <laughs> so you were mistaken. You never met Travis. Well, exactly what are you asking me, Judge? Have I ever met Travis? Yes. No, that's not my question, sir. If the plaintiff is telling me that you had a conversation, which you don't seem to deny in your answer, that you queried her about who the person was who was driving away in the truck. Yes. And she said to you, that's Travis. Because you just told me, that's not Travis. I met Travis, but you thought when you met Travis, you were really meeting Jan because you didn't meet him. You didn't meet him when they looked at the place. No, I, yes, you're right. I did not meet him when they looked at the place. When did you meet Travis for the first time, Strength? See Travis for the first time. Uh, well, you know, I believe it was sometime in April. 